Everybody say, hey, Hamp, we're going to give you more shots, but let's go to Main Street first. What does Main Street think of all the scandals surrounding President Obama and his entire administration? All right, let's ask Ace Polster Scott Rasmussen, founder and president of Rasmussen Reports. Scott, great to see you. What does Main Street think? Does Main Street think this came from some little office in Cincinnati, or is it a bigger story than that? Well, when you talk just about the IRS, 20% believe it came from some rogue employees in Cincinnati. Two out of three think it came from somewhere in Washington. That includes 26% who said it was IRS headquarters and 39% who believe the direction came from somebody working at the White House. And Larry, this is really a significant issue because people don't think this is the norm. Only 19% think the IRS is traditionally used to harass opponents of the president. How big an issue is this going to be? And what is your polling? show how many people are following this Scott? oh well this is a huge issue and a majority say it already qualifies as a scandal it's not just an embarrassment 57 percent believe it was politically motivated in larry the other part six out of ten say they believe other government agencies were also involved in targeting conservatives they don't think it's limited to the irs at all uh, this is the one that i think is the most toxic of the three controversies swirling around the white house because people instinctively fear and distrust the irs remember the old bumper sticker fight organized crime abolish the irs that attitude is there Let's and the others the others don't don't hit the same uh, level of resonance with voters what's the impact on president obama so far it looks mild his approval rating is down from the re-election of course yeah. but so far it doesn't look bad his the approval rating is approval rate yeah, it's 49 percent right now. It's about where it's been. That's not a big deal. There are a couple of hints. There are some changes. Number one, before the scandal, on the question of who do you trust more in ethics and, gov uh, on, and corruption, Democrats had an eight-point edge. Now Republicans have a two-point edge. So there's a ten-point swing. Benghazi's taking a little bit of a toll. Before the last couple of weeks, 46 percent said the president was doing a good job on national security issues. That's down to 39 percent. But overall, the president is doing okay right now. The ground is shifting a bit beneath his feet. Robert Costa.